Outdoorsman 2009 here. Just giving you another update on the Airsoft merchandise I own. I do have these digital. I bought everything in digital camel. As you see, I have this vest here, tactical vest, um, holding my lovely 24/7 the Taurus with a extra mag right there. Does have you know a couple of additional pouches here, magazine pouches, AR-15 pouches. Has a total of one, two, three, four, four total pouches. But I have these double mag stack in here. I don't know if you can see that or not. There's enough light. Uh, it's double mag stacked. You know it's a pretty comfortable vest. Not bad, I got some inside pockets on it. Hold some additional stuff. Does have a belt. Does have some smaller, some handgun magazine holders there. Additional ones. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six additional handguns. Then we have the moly on the back here. Got to get that water. Got to get rehydrated when you're out there, you know, playing that airsoft. Do got the BDUs or the ACUs, whatever you want to call them. I call them BDUs, and this is a digital camel woodlands. Um, I usually play this up in northern Michigan. Got the hat, yeah. Take that hunt with me. And then got that lovely AR-15 sitting there. That's the. This is the system I usually run when I do play. I got two, four, five, six mags for the AR-15. They're batteries, fully charged at this time, ready to rock and roll. I use, you know, these BDUs, the hat, the vest, the handgun, usually that AR-15 or the MP5. Now, when I originally started playing, I bought biodegradable BBs. I do see that they now have paint BBs that you can use. I know a lot of law enforcement agencies are going to these type of weapons, minus the orange, to, uh, you know, sim simulators, I guess you'd call it. Simulation. I know they do do the ones they have the simulation paintball guns also now um, that are pretty cool I've actually went through some training myself and it was pretty neat so I don't know if you guys own any airsoft or you enjoy airsofting but you know if you're here in Michigan and you're close to Detroit or southeast Michigan lower peninsula you know subscribe let me know give me some location I'll come out and play you know I always like to have fun like to get outdoors and I'm sure I'll do an, another review or another update if I get any more I am really want to get these are all plastic by the way I order these offline can't remember the site right now offhand but I'm sure I'll let you know in the future I ordered I think it was six guns I had another MP5, but it was a piece of junk and a broken half when we were in the woods playing. Five, six. I think I got five or six guns from them for like $100. Plastic spring, but you know, $100 for five or six guns, can't beat that. I do have a few more items over here in the tote. There's an additional shirt. Uh, let's see. I did buy little targets. These targets here pop up. They're battery operated. Pop up like that. And you shoot them, they fall down and they re-pop up. Cool, right? Piece of junk, really. Then we got the Colt Airsoft target, which is the same thing basically as that one but this has a net around it so you don't lose your BBs and as you can see a little under nine dollars at Walmart for this 
little piece of glory. And we got uh, biodegradable BBs, 20 gram. So 180 BBs in here. Actually, this is a bio 180. There's actually 5,000 total when I bought the package. Two of those. Have another battery in here. Some additional stuff. Um, let's look at the. I don't know if you can see these or not. A couple additional stuff. This is the product line. What I really want is a sniper rifle. I think that'd be pretty sweet. I'm looking at getting some maybe CO2 or uh, the green gra the green gas. But I think I like the the CO2 would probably be better, but that's extra weight. You know, I don't know why I would even carry it. Maybe add another pouch on here to throw it. Maybe throw it in here. This big pouch. Throw a bunch in there. Get some kind of a holder made made up for some additional ones. I want to get a. They have a Ruger 345, uh, 45. Pretty bad. I don't know if you guys know anything about that Ruger, but the real gun is pretty sweet. Not as sweet as the SR9, I don't think, but you know, in this day, it was good. About three, four years ago. So yeah, I carry most of my stuff in this little tote. Before we get down to the action, I'm gonna tote it around. Like I said, this is my airsoft for now, and I'll get back to you. It's Outdoorsman 2009. Signing.